Hey friends, I want to tell you about a brand new library that I've been very excited about recently. It's called MDX Deck. I'm not sure if you actually heard about it yet on the interwebs at all. And to share with you what it is, I actually made a little slideshow, a little uh, deck that I can actually share with you to present what MDX Deck is all about. So you can see here we have an introduction to MDX Deck, a nice blue background. And you know, the first question you might be asking is, what is MDX? And that is an amazing question. You have a keen intellect and an honest intuition. Uh, MDX is essentially JSX in Markdown. If you are familiar with React, you know that with React you write JSX to actually write your HTML files and that is written in JSX. So that's JSX. And then Markdown is a wonderful format for writing uh, documents with simple markups. So you can write a hash sign to be able to then say this is a header or doing like a dash or a start to make a list item. So essentially MDX lets you put JSX, which is React components, inside of Markdown. It's kind of the uh, best of both worlds in my opinion. There's a link on the screen here as you can see to get more of the finer details about it. But essentially this is what MDX looks like. This is a Markdown file where you can actually import a React component inside that Markdown file. So you see the part here doing a regular import like you would in an ES module. You have that hash sign, which is a accordion, and then you're just rendering the accordion there. So it's kind of this two technologies being merged in this wonderful, beautiful way. So then the question becomes, what is MDX deck? Well, it is MDX based presentation. So you can use MDX to actually make a slideshow presentation. So what can it do? This is straight from its own website, MDX Deck, write presentations, import React components, customizable themes, zero config CLI, presenter mode, speaker notes. That's about all I have on that slide. You can have alternative layouts, so you can have left and right. If you wanna have something that is on the left side, then socially on the right side, this is the way to go. And the coolest part, in my opinion, of MDX Deck is that you can actually include React components inside your deck. So this is actually a live React component. So I'm incrementing it right there, as you can see. I don't know if you can hear me tapping. I'm sure my family's happy that I'm tapping that loud. So let's actually go to the next slide. And you can include any type of components. So you can actually include this one component called React Live, where you can actually just, you know, edit it without any care. Oh, man. And uh, so in fact, in case you weren't aware, this is actually an MDX deck presentation. So let me actually exit this and show you what the actual underlying code of this looks like. You have here my presentation.mdx file, which includes all the slides that you just saw yourself. An introduction to MDX. What is MDX? You can see uh, me showing the JSX for that here. If you go to the bottom, you can see where I was using that counter component. So I actually go into the counter file, you can actually see that counter component there as well, using inline styles to style it. If you wanted to use styled components, a motion to actually style those things there, it's fine to do as well. And why I'm so excited about this MDX deck component is that it is probably the most frictionless way of making a slideshow for any topic that you might have. So for example, if you want to make a new presentation, you could just do touch like, you know, new topic.md, and I can go into that new file right here, and I can just say, you know, hello world, dash, dash, dash for a new slide. This is my presentation, dash, dash, dash. Here are some points I want to tell you about. And actually say, this is the line, point A, point two, and then point three. So now I can save that file, go to package.json. Instead of doing start MDX presentation, I'll do new Topic, save that, and now I can do npm start to run my new presentation. Starts up. Oops, I made a mistake. This actually has to be uh, new topic.mdx, although the extension doesn't really matter, honestly, but you can do that there. So I'm back to package JSON. And you can hit start, it starts up. Do 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 do
And there you have that presentation that we just showed before. Hello world, this is my presentation. Here are some points I wanna tell you about. This is the line point eight, two, and three. And that's really great if you're actually showing a topic that you are interested in sharing with your coworkers at work. Do you wanna actually want to invest that much time in actually making a presentation? This is a amazing way of just having that created with the minimal amount of effort. So you can actually just make a very simple markdown document with all the topic in there and then present it to your coworkers without any real pain points. Most of the times that I'm making a presentation, I actually start in Markdown because I find it the most easiest way to sketch out an idea. And then that I can just take that Markdown file and then just turn it into a presentation is gonna make me wanting to present a lot more to my coworkers. So uh, sorry in advance coworkers for me presenting to that there. There's many other points about MDX deck, which you can read about on the actual MDX website alternate layouts, you can customize, you can have speaker notes, presenter notes. Uh, you can also just do whatever, whatever you can do in React, you can do in MDX Depth. That's where the true flexibility comes in. So I'm very excited about this new piece of technology. I think it's gonna make it much more easier to just make presentations. If you want to actually talk at a meetup, this is a great way to get going. If you want to just hash out an idea, make a markdown document, start putting some things in there. If you actually care about more details, you can then break out into keynote or spectacle or any more, um, complicated uh, uh, deck-based presenter layout because this is simple but so powerful because it just leverages the whole React ecosystem. That is MDX Deck. Hopefully you are now ex as excited about it as I am. And I'm looking forward to seeing your future presentations that I can then maybe share on this channel. If you have something you wanna share, I'm happy to you know, present it to everybody else as well. And I'll catch you again next week for a new interesting topic.